Hi everyone. Hi. I hope you are doing well. I hope you had a lovely week. I hope everything is going on well. Well, today we are going to be taking you through the Uganda Law Society election. Now, today is a bit different, but being a Friday, we should keep expecting more different and more different things. So, as privileged to be able to attend. Should I say attend? Yeah. I think I attended. Yeah, I attended the election. Should I say election voting? Yeah, I witnessed. I was able to, as privileged to witness the voting of the new president, the new vice president, new treasurer of the Uganda Law Society. Apparently, just like every other institution, uh, goes ahead to vote for the leaders, for the people they want to you know to lead them to show them how things should be done to impose particular rules and to put particular things in place uganda law society was doing the same on the 12th of september 2020 and i was privileged to be there so just to take you through what really happened apparently there were different the different voting points yeah uh, I got to learn that there was uh, a point at LDC, the Law Development Center. There was a post in Nakawa, and then there was a post at the commercial court. Now, I, I happened to be at the commercial court, and uh, in this video, we're going to be seeing what transpired. Uh, it's just, it's, it's quite normal. It's, it's the normal things, the normal way of voting. Like, um, like any other kind of voting actually yeah as 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 they are as there and you know this law has actually looked no more <laughs> being a saturday i did not see anyone clad on a suit or being randomly smart you know it was all easy uh or honestly for some reasons i felt like maybe they would they would be a bit strict of, of you cannot record you know how those things be but I was really honored. Uh, everything was really, really okay. Like I was there moving with my phone and and recording. And there's no, as you not say anything. Like no one had, <laughs> no one had a problem of like, excuse me, what are you doing? Or excuse me, why are you recording? Or excuse me, what are you recording for? You know, as even um, as I was able to interview a few of. The lawyers that i was able to you know get access to i asked them how they felt about the voting if, if they felt the need to you know some people are comfortable having a system running itself i don't know how that works but i feel like uh i don't know i don't know if everyone out there loves to go out there and vote but um i can promise you it was quite smooth you know like everyone would arrive these guys have posh cards you guys lawyers have made it in life okay everyone else has made it in life but these guys have made it in life i mean i got there and i'm like oh oh okay okay you know <laughs> everything looked so good and so calm they are quite quite organized and disciplined persons i can say as they're going to see in the video they 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 queued up they are in a line and moving gently orderly you know like civilized persons live alone these things of scrambling and they all were they are they, they were honored I, I, for, for the few that I talked about, the, uh, that I talked to, were honored to be in the place of, um, you know, like in the position to vote because I can promise you it comes with a lot of requirements. I, um, the requirements include uh, you, you actually have to be a subscribed member of the Uganda Law Society. And I had for you to be a member, you have to pay an amount of approximately 540000 That is that is not little money that is not little money so yes we we how should i say should i say we congratulate you or we are <laughs> how should i put it like you guys have fulfilled your civic duty like you you you've done what you ought to be doing you you sacrifice your little money and and go out there and pay it all up and be able to do these kinds of things yeah 
so of course being a subscribed mem subscribed member to the uganda law society was um qualification number one then you had to have a uganda law society id it was another another should i say necessity like another qualifier for you to actually get in there and cast your vote yeah then you had to oh the list okay if you do not have your uganda law society id the list you'd have is a national id yeah also you had to be at the branch where you were registered apparently when you register you have numbers and all those things you know so you 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 had to go through a it's very good to change leadership because with new leaders you get new ideas mm. and you get to experience something really new. Some candidates even from their slogans mm. we are changing we are voting for a fearless and a modern and a fearless bar. So it comes with new leadership. So we are very excited people are giving us very good promises mm. they can put them into action that will be very good and that's why we are here. We have aspirants, five aspirants. Mm. We have Bernard Omundo, we have Nelson Walusimbi, we have Iona Wall, Navasa, we have Sema Morashid and Anne Karunji. Mm. That is in no particular order, but those are the aspirants for presidency. The lawyer and everyone that to vote, because when you vote, you have spoken. Don't leave it to chance, please. If you have the vote, if you're eligible to vote, come and vote. Our president, the vice president and the treasurer, it's your duty and let us exercise it. Mm -hmm. My name is Lydia Anton. I'm an advocate of the High Court of Canada and a support lady. As a paid up member, it's my mandate to vote. It's a right, it's a constitutional right. I feel that an obligation. And this thing is going well. Uh -huh. mm. uh, as a member, that's one of my obligation as a member. And also as a right. Mm. Paid up member, you know we have to engage. Uh, okay. Uh, leadership because we also engage as members, we engage the customer. Mm. Uh, customer. Okay. I'm Chief Commandant, I'm a I feel so happy because this is civic. I am a Commissioner Advocate. Today we are voting our union list president, the vice president, and um, the treasurer. I am so happy being part of this team. It's a civic duty to put our leaders and uh, I have voted uh, what I think will actually deliver, deliver and uh, I feel honored. I feel honored to be part of this uh, exercise. So you guys, apparently at the end of the day, the, <laughs> the whole, should I say council, should I say the whole committee is female. Like people decided. The president uh, was feeling, okay, the president who has voted into power is the Fiona World Nasaba. The vice president is Dana Anguich. The secretary is Rita Nama. Namachika Nangono. Nang, eh? Nang, no? The treasurer is Shane Gloria Musa. Musa Nase. So, yeah, people voted. People casted their votes. People showed up and they voted females into power. You guys will be okay. Yeah. But yeah, we are so honored. We are so glad. I mean, let, let's 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 see how the women do this let's see how the women do this you know as us coming back and as told <laughs> the people that i went with to vote apparently uh one was a diehard a supporter of uh, bernard Owundo, and another was a 
big supporter of Nelson Walusimbi. So you can imagine that yeah, eh, at that point in time. Uh, we are so we are so happy for you, the guys who made it through. We are so happy for you. We congratulate you. We know, we know, we know you are capable of doing great things, and we can only trust that you deliver. Guys, that is as much as we could bring for you today. I mean, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you love this video, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, please share the link, share this video with everyone else so they know, they get a feel of what happens when lawyers are voting. We love you, you guys. Take care of yourselves. Please, thank you for loving us. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for commenting. Keep the comments coming. Keep loving us. If, you don't, if you've not subscribed to the channel, please tap the subscribe word. It's as easy as just tapping the word. The word is red. It turns black to show that you've fully subscribed. It's free of charge. You do not pay a coin to subscribe. Yeah. And we can only thank you as much. So, yeah. See you on Tuesday. Don't forget to check out our Friday videos. We love you. Take care and stay safe. Bye.